technology, Enos is all technology. This is a new technology combining the tech Enos, which is a separate instrument from the which is a separate instrument. At JFB, what we do is we know the cat and the dog smell and they taste the flavor. So we are trying to model what they smell and what they taste. We get the data from each of the instruments of the Enos separately and from the Enos separately. So then we combine the data and give us the Enos data. Um, what we do is figure one shows up. Of the emails, oh, the only thing you have to do is to wait the sample to export files, and that gives us the aroma profile of the plant. On the inside, what we do is we basically get a water extract of the plant. We have the hydrophobic compound coming into the solution, and the inside sensor is basically brought into the solution to taste it based on that taste distribution. Figure one shows a bit of a lot of different flavors and different samples that we analyze on both instruments. They combine there. And then in the middle is control A, which shows us the discrimination between the samples on the left, which are less desirable, and the samples on the right, which are more desirable. So basically, using the E of the tongue helps us reduce the product development cycle time because it helps us screen multiple formulation variables. We can we can see from the plot which ones we can go further to process the result or which ones we should terminate. And on the table, we can see that the process result actually correlates well with what the instrument results are. Another application which we use the e of some technology for that AIB is quality control purposes. We um, use the instrument to determine outline in a finished flavor. The fingerprint shows us the good control region. Which is the region we want all our flavors based on the specification. And outside, anything that falls outside tells us the outline. We do that quite a bit with our quality control pairing of purposes of the flavor. And the company shows us the correlation between what we get from the two bowl passage results and what the e notation instrument gives us. In conclusion, we can see that the e tone gives us no, we only need minimal sample preparation. It's fast, it's a stable process of preparing the sample. And the results that we get from it is able to help us with this product development cycle time by helping us to screen multiple formulation variables. Also, we can use the e tone to help us determine outliers in the control. Thank you.